Okay guys, welcome back to another episode of Great Tech New Horizons. Like I mentioned in the last episode, this video is pretty much just back to back with the also re recording wise. It's pretty much back to back with the the other the other episode. So, we did some exploring last episode because we needed to gather some materials. I am going to go back and try to gather some more of that clay, see if I can find some of that elusive clay. Because the sooner we can get, an, get a cook oven up and running, the sooner we can start lighting up our base and explore down below and do some mining. It's going to be a little bit of, bit of a quest. Let's see, other than that, we have. I could take a bacon cheeseburger. I'm gonna take a loop back because you never know. What do we get? What do we get? Beet salad and a leather cap. That's a little some protection. And boom! There's there the there's that food gone. I've seen. It's gotta be. It's gotta be some. It's gotta be something. The clay's gotta be. It's gotta be somewhere. Am I seeing something over here? Did I see something? No, I didn't. There's some. There's one piece of clay. I only needed three more, and, and I don't like swimming that far away from my hole. I can see some clay over there, so that's that's a was it over here maybe? There we go. There we go. I'm probably gonna get some sand real quick just to clear out that area. Make it easier for me and not drown while I'm while I'm down there. I just realized something. The terrain is gonna be look looking awful once I'm done here. Well good thing I'm not exploring anymore. Well after this. Good thing when I, once I get my base up, really up and running, then that won't be a problem. Because I will never have to look at this again. That stack should do. Just confirming that it's over here. Okay, so I'm just gonna have to. I figure the clay is extending down there, so I might I need to clear away all the water from here and not. Drown trying to do it. I'm gonna mark off this area and just try to fill this in with sand and then just digging that up again. It's not the best strategy, but it works for me, so and I've immediately forgot where my where I put the, put the borders. But hey, at least I'm not drowning. I'm gonna grab a lot of clay just to make sure that we have plenty of it. And of course, sand Sand has gravity, so that's it's always a fun one. It doesn't work to my advantage. Any more? No. I think there wasn't any more. There we go. There's I think we should have enough clay. We have okay, it comes in fours, so I'm guessing I dropped a piece back here. Uh, eh, it's not. It's not a big deal. So that's that done. I also need to gather. I should, I should just gather some more sand just in case I didn't bring enough last time. I already can't remember what I how many pieces I brought back last episode. And what one valid mining strategy is to just. Like dig straight down and hope and help and get the sun to light everything up. That's sort of, that's kind of valid strategy, but at the same time, it's not really the the best because at night time it's still going to be dark, and I want to keep mining it like at all time, like all day, instead of just a certain amount of time every day. And if you can hear my. My dog barking again. I'm s sorry if that's that got caught on my microphone. 
it probably hopefully it's not but I've done a little bit of tweaking on my microphone so it should in theory not and by the way just wanted to add that I'm planning on streaming on, on this weekend which would be okay so today it's Wednesday Thursday Friday so it will be on the 25th of October well that's at least a that's the plan at least. So I need to So I'm if you get if you get on my Twitch, you can probably find me there on Friday. Twitch.tv slash Hunter of the Ancients. The link will be in the description. And I'll be probably i I'll think I'll I think I made it made a made a um I think I'm gonna be gonna be collaborating with another streamer that I know. I'm, I won't tell you more than that, so you're just gonna have to have to go and see for yourself. Okay. In a strange vision, you saw a big structure. Yeah, the coke oven. We know. Already talked about it. We got some fence gates and some pumpkin oat scones. Hmm. It's food at least. I got a lot I got a lot of coins right now. Let's see what else. We have gravel, we have sand. We need to have all the clay in my inventory. Two almost three stacks of coal of clay. That should be plenty. We gotta get the loot bag again. We got blood sapling, eucalyptus sapling. Ghostwood sapling, and redwood sapling, and hopseed sapling. Hmm. And some Sakura saplings, of course. I also I need to build more chests. Impskin leggings. Okay, that's that's pretty good. I need to build another chest now, don't I? The chests were what? Planks, flint, and oak logs. Of course it was. Good thing I got all these logs. I can already tell. You know, if you haven't already tell, you can already you can already tell by my voice, and I'm not too excited about grinding this. But I knew what I got myself into, so I'm just gonna have to live with it. I'm gonna place my bed down again. And sleep. Because the point of it is so that I don't have to fight any mobs during the day. I put all this away down here right now. I'm gonna have to put all away all these. I think I'm gonna have saplings and seeds and stuff in this one. And Only dice can go there, I'm, I guess. I'll probably get a better sorting system going at some point, but for now, this is gonna have this is gonna have to do. Gonna make it so that anything that's not edible, like food or set anything really that's related to food but can't be directly eaten, if that makes sense, or something related to nature, for example, natural stuff that just can't be eaten. That's, that has a use, but it's not, but not an eating use. If that makes any sense. Okay, there we go. What else? What else? I already claimed that. Maceration version 0 0.1 alpha, making a mortar. Okay, a mortar is made, I think it's five stone into flint, if I recall correctly. It's been a while since I've played with a Greg Tech mod pack, so I'm thinking, yeah, it is five stone. I'm guessing that's why you want me to make all those, make all the gravel and get all the gravel and smelt up the stone, because he knew I'm going to be using mortars a lot. There's that, there's some more coins. I'm guessing they don't have a use in the 
again, in, like a sort of a shopping thingamajig in this. Something to carry liquids. Oh, I'm way ahead of you since I got the iron bucket. An unfired clay bucket. Which is made how? I'm guessing porcelain clay or something. No, it's just clay dust, which means I need to I need to process it through the. Yeah, of course, I do. What? No, I don't. Oh, I need to make. Okay, how? There are so many steps to this, aren't? Isn't there? Yep, I'm gonna have to go down and make me some clay buckets. The clay clay blocks the old-fashioned way, apparently. Need to get. Let me go back. Fuck it, there's gonna be a lot of running back and forth, isn't there? Think about it, I should have made my base close to the water. I might as well just. Well, I didn't, well, I'll have to find some way to get a lot of water close to my base. If there are any barrels or rainwater tanks, maybe that could be a way. Like, every time it's raining, I can make it useful and not save me the trouble of walking back and forth. So I might as well just stay over here. Now I have a now that I have a clay bucket. I mean, I could actually bring a get a furnace going as well. I think I have I have the flint, of course. I have to dig find find one of those holes I made earlier. Back by this tree. I can't dig any more. Any well, there we go. Hit the rocks. Just need six pieces of this. Perfect. Now I also had a crafting table with me because I thought ahead. There we go. This is what I'm going to be. It's going to be me doing this. I need to macerate. I need to grind that down into cold dust. Play dust. I need to make two more, I think. Of course, I need water for that. Do, 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 do. There we go. Mortar. There we go. And boom. You good? Next, we need to need to fire it. I guess the ice is gonna melt now. Any minute, isn't it? Okay, that was weird. There we go. That complete. Here it is. Okay, raisin cookies or peanut butter cookies. Mm, I think I'm gonna Less, lesser of two evils. Peanut butter. There we go. Let's see. Book parts, wood pulp, and paper. Paper is no longer made with sugar canes. Yeah, you will now need wood pulp. You will need a lot of wood to craft wood pulp. Let me guess, it's just like this, isn't it? What the hell? Okay. How much did I need? A stack of it. So, like 32 pieces of wood then. I need to remember to replant the trees just so it doesn't like. So it keeps growing trees. And there goes that. And there went that one. Another one. There we go. That's one part done. Now to make it into paper. Let's start with the water again, isn't it? <sighs> okay, you see now what I mean by it being so 
damn grindy. Two more, two more. Two more and we're done. There we go. Jesus. Finite water? That's a problem, that's for sure. Last night you had an idea. If you can drink cacti, you should also be able to make water out of a cacti and use that for most recipes to require water. How cool is that? So you're telling me... You want me to find a desert? Or something? I need, I need to, by the way, I need to move back to my, my base for now. What's the next part? Need to cons Okay, and it just needs some... Oh no, I don't need to find... Oh, never mind. I didn't need, need to find one. I just I just read it. It says... I need, I need to give him some wood and then he'll get give me some cacti. So I can start a farm. I don't have to, so I don't actually have to go out and explore and find that find a desert or something. And by the way, I also... I didn't know... I don't know if I've already mentioned this, but I... Put on the realistic world gen, so it might look your world might look a little different with different world gens. Like the biomes are supposed to be more or less like how it would be if it was like a real one, like a real world. That's at least how it's supposed to be on paper. So okay, let's see. I had some more, didn't I? Yep. There we go. Now we have the resources to make a cacti farm. Which I'm gonna place actually down here, I think. I'm gonna have to dig out some of this stuff in order to do that though. I'll be back in a second once I've dug out a little bit of space for me. And there we have it. A small cacti farm. It's probably gonna evolve like with everything else, but for now that's it'll it'll work. It'll do the do the trick. What else do we have? We have Tinker Time. Me and we getting getting into Tinker's construct. Finally. I didn't realize I can just I can just sleep. I forgot to sleep. But Let's see, I can I think I'm gonna do this little this little piece of little, little, this little quest real quick and then I think I'm gonna end the episode I think. I am, I'm just not sure how long I've been recording for. Oh for f oh you, you motherfuckers. Okay, I see how it is. Good thing I had some strength from another from another quest, so that's one piece. Oops. That, 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 boom, 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 boom. Mallet. There we go. That's one piece. Now we need stencil table. Stencil table. And AI, can you please? I don't know why with this mod pack it's pretty it's slow to load. I'm not too sure about that. How, how do I make blank patterns? Okay, I need to do it like this. So what do I need? I need Sticks and fences. We need a mallet and on the blank parent. There we go, there's a stencil table. Tool station. Tools it's not a station, but a tool station. Come on any eye. Come on any eye. There we go. Crafting station. Or do I uh, I can just use the crafting table, never mind. I was, was worried for a second. Uh, let's see. Four six. There we go. Now a blank pattern. Uh, paper. 
I should have everything I need. There we go. Now a pattern chest. That's what what could that possibly be? A chest, of course. Boom, boom. And there we go. And Bob's your uncle. More coins and some more blank patterns. Great. Forming press version 0 0.1. As you may have noticed, you cannot turn clay into bricks directly. Yeah, and actually, we looked up some of the recipes earlier. Well, to be fair, it wasn't a good recipe anyway. Well, fuck you then. You probably end up with something bread shaped. Fair enough, I guess. So in order to make bricks, you need a form. Well, I told you. Oh, just one more quest. I guess. Form, then. It's not a pattern, it's a form. You dumbo, it's a form, not a... Not a pattern. Let's see where where there it is. I guess it, it's gonna be real specific, isn't it? There it is. That's a quick one. Cows. That's next my next hunting target. Another brick in the wall. Quest updated, you're not prepared. Hey, what? Okay, they open up some more. They open up some more categories. Let's see, coins, coins, coins. So I guess this, oh, this is where I'm supposed to be putting in all these. Ah, that makes sense. So I can... But, but the thing is... I keep getting coins, of course, but... How do I... Like, are there repeatable quests so I don't run out of those coins? Is there a way to make them? I, I, I highly doubt it, but... Uh, yeah, I doubt it. They're just question rewards. Yeah, that's what I can't. That's kind of what I thought. But I'm guessing with like as with every questing mod thing, there's usually a a bunch of repeatable quests you can do in order to get those to get the coins in order to make to make those in order to, to purchase more stuff. Like they wouldn't just give you a limited amount and now here, Harry, Harry, have a bunch. You just we just gave you a bunch of coins. Spend them wisely or something. But the mod pack has fucked me over more times, so wouldn't be surprised if that's the case. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video of Greg Tech New Horizons. I'm um, apologies for not uploading within the last two weeks. As I said, I've been recording this episode and then last one back to back so hopefully that will make make up for it and um yeah if you enjoy the video feel free to leave a like if you didn't enjoy the video then feel free to leave a dislike and as always i highly appreciate any feedback you can make if you enjoy the video if there's something you wanted me to something you want me to explain better or if there's something you're wondering if you have any questions then feel free to leave a comment down below and i'll see you guys in the next episode peace out